So you like text effects? Well, how about free text effects? I don't know why you'd say no. So today, my friends, I have for you three free text effects that you can use on any project in DaVinci Resolve 16 and 17, and that's including the free version. But first, if you're new here, my name is Billy Ripka, and I make weekly videos all about teaching you to become a better video editor. So if you wanna level up your editing skills, click that subscribe button and the bell notification to stay up to date on the newest videos put out but let's get into it. So in terms of the text effects that we have in this pack, there are three of them, the mirror, the neon, and the 3D text. Now I'm aware that some of you hate to go inside of the fusion tab because of all the different nodes and stuff that you just haven't learned yet, but you still want awesome looking text effects. So that's where this comes in. Each one of these is meant to be used on the edit tab. So you don't have to go into fusion at all and mess with any crazy settings. They're all there for you. So to make these text effects work, you need to install them in the proper place. Don't worry, I've given you all the instructions you need and I'm gonna show you right now. So once you've downloaded the text effects, you'll go to your downloads page right here. Then you'll see it up at the top. You have the BR text effects. What you're gonna do is right click on it go to extract all and then select your destination if it's anything but that and hit extract. Now, once it's done, you'll have the unzipped folder below it. So open that up and then you'll see you have three files. You have fonts, text effects, and a readme. So with the fonts, I've given you the fonts that I used when originally making these text effects. Now it's not exclusive, so you can use any font you want. So if you want that cool brush font, it's right there. All you'll do is double click on this and then double click on one of the fonts and hit install. It's as easy as that. Now for the actual effects themselves, whether you're on Mac or PC, you're gonna have to place them in a specific folder. So under this readme right here, I've given you those locations. So you can easily copy them and then paste it in this search bar right here. Or if it's not working for you, what you'll do is go to your C drive. It's the drive that has a C right next to it. And you're gonna right click, then go to open in new window. So now that we've done that, you have your program files right here. Open that up, then go to Blackmagic Design, DaVinci Resolve, then Fusion, Templates, Edit, and uh, one more, Titles. So once you're here, right, you're not gonna have the exact same files because I have other packs in there like my other call out pack. You're gonna open up the text effects folder right here then highlight both of them, hit Control C for copy because I just, that's just what I do. Then right click and select paste. And then check, do this for all current items. So that's it for the actual installation. If you've done all that with DaVinci Resolve opened, just close the whole program down and restart it. Then to use the actual effects, what you'll do is go to the effects library right here, then go to titles, then you'll see your BR 3D text right here. So you just grab that thing, drag it onto the timeline. You can stretch it out, make it as long as you want. Oh, also, if you like these text effects, a like would totally help this video out. So uh, thank you guys. And also in the inspector tab, if you click on it, you'll have all of these different options right here, which are just other parameters you can tweak. And the same thing goes for the mirror text effect right here and the neon. Each one of them has their own custom menu and allows you to tweak other parameters. Like with the mirror, you can change the blur strength and move around the center if you want to really make a different effect. You can change the soft edge. So if you want the fade to be a little less or you just don't want it there altogether, you can drag down the border width. Anyway, if you want more text effects just like this, let me know in the comments below so I know which ones actually to make and do stuff like that. And also, if you want more videos just like this, click on the top for a video with all of my DaVinci Resolve tutorials or click on the bottom for a video that YouTube thinks that you would like. But until the next one, peace.